Hi, it's Darren, the Window Cleaner, Green Pro Clean Limited, Window Cleaning in Nottingham and Derbyshire. Today is um, Retail Therapy Day, Unboxing Day. Um, no, it's not the new iPhone. Yet when I was a young man, cell phones were about this size and probably about as heavy. What we've got in the box today is a, another, this is our second one um, that we've had in the last four years. Our other one has lasted four years. Still going strong. Charlie, knock it off. Still going strong, but this is a new one for another product we're working on. This is the Waterworks HD Power Up Reel, and we've got the box upside down, so I'm just going to flip it over as soon as I find the hole in the drum. Uh, never mind, I'll get it from there. There we go. There we go. And the Waterworks Power Up HDs are from Jordan down at Waterworks in Corby. Um, I believe you can also get them through. Um, the window cleaning warehouse down in Southampton. Um, there we go, a little jiggle. Out she comes. Let me just shift this box off. And these are a great, solid, sturdy piece of equipment. Very well built and very heavy, actually. So I'm going to turn this carefully and I'll show you the workings of it. But these are the new models out. They look very similar. We'll show you another clip in a minute of our current ones. They look very similar to the uh, old models. Uh, I'm going to cut the slight differences. They now have exactly the same as before. They'll hold um, an easy 80 meters of 8 mil or 100 meters of 6 mil. Um, but the face plates now, here's the first thing you'll notice. Stainless steel instead of the powder coated um, old fashioned ones. You'll see ours is slightly rusty in the van. And in fact, I'll cut over to the van for a second. Let you take a look at the old one and then we'll come back and do a quick comparison. So this is our four year old Waterworks Power Up HD. As you can see, it's got the old school uh, metal um, plate on there that was powder coated back in the day, a little rusty. Now those are now stainless, as you see on our new one here. Um, in fact, Andy's got a load of line out there, so we're just gonna wind this in quickly. And uh, push button operated, of course, just the yellow push box there. Pop on that, get yourself a handful. We always wrap the cloth around it because it keeps it clean. But as you can see, even after four years, it's still working good and strong. So definitely a reliable piece of kit and a brilliant addition to once he gets all that tangle out of his hose. Don't know how he got that in such a mess. Bear with me. There we go. And uh, yeah, so anyway, back to winding that in. There we go. Lovely jubbling. So to, to all the people that sit there still going on about, oh yeah, hand winding, I'm a man, yada yada yada, etc, etc. Um, waste of time, mate. It's your time and you wind up your hose how you like. But at the end of the day, you can't beat a good old electric power up HD reel. So as you've seen in the van, that's the old one. That's one we've had for four years, still going strong. Reason for our trip to Waterworks yesterday was the fact that uh, I snapped the chain on it. And when I say I snapped the chain on it, that's exactly what I mean because it was... Um, I'd actually installed it incorrectly and the chain wasn't properly tensioned and so entirely my fault. But Jordan got us sorted, got us back on the road, but we're working on another project so we need another reel. And uh, as you can see, here's your inlet hose, uh, nice brass barb job, straight in there with your water in and then obviously your hose onto there will connect up to another nice brass in the middle there. Oh, sorry Andy, to see if you see there, happy days. And then off we rock. It's got um, a new style of spacer on it that uh, tensions the chain better to get less jumping off. Because on the old reels, the chain was prone to occasionally stepping off, but now that's something that has been cured to a vast degree. If you want to know how simple these are, four holes in the base plate, one on each corner, bolt it straight into the floor of your van. Then literally all you do, this is the junction box for your cables. You've got a positive and a negative right there. You've got your inline fuse, boom, 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 boom. I think it's, a, it's probably a 10 amp, I don't know. I like it's a 30 amp inline fuse. Go straight to your pos and your neg on your leisure battery. If you're running a split charge relay, this will not put a huge drain on your battery. So this will operate both your window cleaning pump and your reel, no problem at all for most batteries. And then ours, we didn't splash out for the remote version. We've just got the push button version, which in our van you can see is mounted up behind the reel or you can have it loose so that you can have it in your hand, wind your reel in. Now, one of the best pieces of kit, I did a, a review this morning on the um, Univalve, which I said was one of the best pieces of kit on the market for water-fed pole, as is the Waterworks Power Up HD. Um, Jordan will be at the show next week on the 8th of September, the WCW show. I will post a, a link for the show down below. 
Um, and I happen to know these retail about £410 plus the VAT. Um, however, he will be doing a show special where he's giving away 10 units. I say giving away, he's selling 10 units um, at cost price. £2.99 plus the VAT to the first 10 customers. So um, perhaps maybe even give him a little tinkle over the weekend. Uh, drop him an old PM there and see if maybe you can RSVP perhaps. Um, after that, they will still be at a show special discount. Uh, which I believe is going to be 339 plus for that. So you'll still be saving yourself 80, 90 quid, even if you miss out on the first 10. But now has lasted four years, so it's less than 100 pound a year for us for these reels, and absolutely superb. No backache, no arm ache, just continuous reel in, reel out, day in, day out. So hope you like this review. We'll show you this one in situ when we finish our new project in a, in a week or two's time. And um, any comments, guys, bang them in the box below. Apart from that, have a great weekend. Thanks for watching.